On February 19, 1942, FDR signed Executive Order 9066. 9066 put the Secretary of War and his commanders in charge of deciding where the military zones would be and who should be removed. It gave the military power over the Attorney General to make these decisions without any hearings or due process. This was unprecedented power for a president, even for FDR. He asked Congress to support Executive Order 9066, and it did. Congress followed that with Public Law 503, which then gave it power. The laws did not specifically name any race or ethnic group, but allowed the military to impose restrictions on anyone it deemed a threat. But 